Hey, what's up, y'all? It's Kane Paul Willie, and man, we're finally back fishing. It's the beginning of March, starting to feel a little bit like spring out here, but just drove three and a half hours, and I'm at the state park. I got a campsite reserve, so I'm gonna be here today and tomorrow. I've got some worms and some different artificials, but I'm gonna float around this lake for two days and hopefully catch some fish. So y'all stay tuned. I'm gonna fish this afternoon till it gets dark. Then I'm gonna camp out tonight, do a little car camping. Then tomorrow we're gonna wake up, hit it again. Hopefully get some fish, start the season out strong. But you guys stay tuned. We're about to get into it. first worm here I'm off real shallow I'm not sure they're gonna be this shallow but just need to throw it out there and get that first cast out of the way oh got a little nipple right there already there's something oh my gosh first worm and we're on them no joke man I was all paranoid super worried man i just haven't been fishing in so long but there we go a big old slab crappie first worm oh my gosh right here by the boat ramp always barely hooked man i talked i heard overheard so many folks there at the boat ramp talking about getting their butt kicked today look at that slab on the first worm of the spring first cast of this season and a huge crappie the biggest i've ever caught holy cow literally just got out of my car look at that huge crappie for me oh my gosh incredible <laughs> oh my god first cast of the season baby it's about to be on look at that fish first freaking cast of the season incredible gotta make sure my gopro's recording okay it is holy cow man just like that y'all first cast of the season Woo! oh got one. Oh heck yeah got me a fish over here i'm not sure what it is always tangled up in the weeds oh shoot gotta be gentle with him oh man he's on there but he's tangled up i believe oh he's still shaking his head let's see if we can get him off there back around these weeds heck yeah man second fish after that first fish oh man did he get off There he is, heck yeah. Got a tiny little shell cracker. Second fish out here on the worms, man. These are some European night crawlers I've been raising myself, but man, second fish, little shell cracker. Yeah, fish on. Third fish. Got a little bluegill here. Small guy. Heck yeah, fish number three. Not bad. Three species. Pretty darn quick too. Heck yeah, man, he's way shallow. 
One of my favorite parts about this lake is the dead forest of trees right in the middle of the water. Man, it's so cool. There's all these black birds this time. I'm not sure what they are. Pretty cool though. All right, well, not a bad day of fishing. My first day back of the season. Man, it feels good to get on some fish. Managed to get three species today. I got a crappie, a shell cracker, and a bluegill. But man, we're losing light here. Sun is going down, so I'm about to paddle back to the boat ramp. And then now I'm gonna drive over to my campsite and just take it easy. I got my mattress in my car, so I'm gonna do a little car camping, and just crash out. But I'll check in with you guys a little bit later tonight. And uh, hopefully we get on them tomorrow. I'll kind of scout out the lake and hopefully got some good spots. So we'll see. All right, we got us a full moon tonight. Man, got a great campsite right here on the water's edge. All right, here's a sleeping situation we got. Man, I've used this on a couple road trips, but I just a real thin mattress here. Got my seats basically laid back. Got my pillow, got a 20 degree sleeping bag, but essentially your feet go down in the trunk and it's a little bit elevated just because the seats don't go perfectly flat but honestly i just kind of curl up diagonal and man it's actually not bad at all I'll pass right out doing a little firewood gathering i'm probably not going to be up too long but man look at all this good firewood oh yeah it's a little stunt Man, gotta bring a good book with you. I've been reading a bunch of Stephen King. The cover actually came off this one, but this is his uh, alter ego, Richard Bachman. And this is actually four books in one. It's Rage, The Long Walk, Roadwork, and Running Man. Just finished Rage, man. Not sure what to think about that one. A little bit too wild for me, but I've listened to these three on audiobook, and man, they're incredible. I'm actually working my way reading through the long walk and man it's so good man nice sunrise this morning slept okay survived the night in the car it really wasn't too bad it got a little cold i think it was supposed to be 44 but man sleeping bag did fine i stayed plenty warm but i'm about to get up out of here kind of repack the car make sure i got all my supplies i'm gonna make a breakfast and then we're about to hit the water Hey, what's up, y'all? It's the next morning, and I just got my campsite all packed up. Just took a little shower under the faucet, kind of wash my face off, wash my hair off, but man, we're ready to go. I still got some worms left over. I got the spinning rod and reel all rigged up. I'm about to throw that same setup I had yesterday, just a little float rig with a split shot and true turn hook, long shank. We're gonna keep going for these panfish. But man, I was pumped up to catch that crappie yesterday on the first cast of the season. Man, great way to start out. But we're going to hit it again today. I'm about to launch the boat over here at the boat ramp, but it's supposed to get up to a 70. So man, I'm feeling good about our chances. We're just going to keep at it and hopefully get some fish. Got one. Heck yeah, first bite today. Oh man, thank God the GoPro's going. What the heck do I have? Big old slab crappie. 
Oh shoot, big old slab, baby. Oh yeah, stay on there. Oh man, big old slab daddy in the weeds. Holy cow, look at that crappie on the worm. Oh man, I'm so pumped up. I hadn't, hadn't, hadn't even had a single bite today. I was fishing real shallow. Almost didn't think I was, or thought I was fishing way too shallow, but look at that. Heck yeah, I gotta get a picture. Man, look at this long crappie. Heck yeah. We got a lot of old lily pads. The new ones haven't grown in yet this year, but I'm just dropping worms in between the little gaps, and that's where I got that crappie. Alright y'all, that's a wrap on this weekend. I had a great time out here. Two days of fishing and one overnight camp out. Man, I've been needing a little getaway. It's like I've been cooped up this winter, so I had to just start the season out with a bang. It's a little bit of a drive, about three and a half hours from where I live, but it's one of my favorite lakes in the state. When I was into photography, I used to come down here a lot. They got beautiful water lilies, all the lily pads and lotus flowers. It's still a little bit early for all that, but man, we had a great time. Got those crappie, got that crappie on the first cast of the season, man. What a way to start it out. It's just the first of many trips coming this spring and this summer. So you guys stay tuned and I'll catch you guys on the next one. Peace.